Hey everybody, welcome back to my Ethermod tour. And as you can see here, we've got a little farting bunny. <laughs> Let's jump into the game and check him out. That's cool. There he is. Yeah, this is version 1.02. It's the patch. Just came out a couple of days ago. And I have it installed, obviously. And we have new mobs. A whole bunch of bug fixes. Some tweaks. New features, new items. And this is one of the new things right here. It's a little bunny that seems to propel him or herself across the ether world with little puffs of farts. Poof! Just like that. Look at that. It's one way to get around. <laughs> it's odorless too. That's good. Ah, oh, what? You're so cute. Come here, but there's something else I need to show the, the kind people watching. And this is just for science. Just close your eyes. This won't hurt a bit. Well, probably not. Just come... Da, 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 da. Oh. <laughs> you little farty machine, you. Get over! Oh, it's like a zar. And... Yes, he did. He dropped string. So I've got the list of tweaks and fixes here in the change log on another computer and I'm gonna run down some of the changes and continue my little discovery tour so I'm not just gonna read it off to you and spew a whole bunch of information at you boring like we're gonna play the game and discover stuff in the tour so anyway that's one of the new things little air bunnies and they drop string and that's important because we can make um, saddles with leather and string only. So now before version 1.2, we would have to go all the way back to Minecraft, the surface as they call it, to kill cows for leather and spiders for string. But no longer. That is no longer the case. Now we have little farting bunnies to kill. All right, let's check something else out. This is There's a few rather significant tweaks and changes. One of them is Ambrosium. Now only heals, as you can see, half a heart per item. So that's going to make um, fighting bosses a lot harder because of their... their whoa, whoa, geez. Hang on, guys. I'm just talking. Um, it was actually fairly easy to get a hold of Ambrosium. It probably still is. I don't think that the uh, frequency of Ambrosium has been tweaked at all, but um, obviously you're not going to be able to heal as efficiently with it. I don't want you. So, um, but there is another healing item, and it's called a healing stone, I believe, and I'll have to look that up, but it's something that can be crafted with Ambrosium in an enchanter. Tim the enchanter, and I'm going to make an enchanter. And we'll make one of those healing stones. It's stackable, and I think it heals... Oh, where is it? I think, it, I think it's two. Two hearts. So we'll make one of those. Or rather, several. Something else that's been tweaked and fixed, which makes me very happy, is the mob spawns. So these Zephyr guys that fly around and shoot puffballs at you to knock you off your feet to your death below, apparently their uh, frequency has been reduced somewhat. And there was a bug with them too, because they weren't despawning properly. And because they weren't despawning, then other mobs weren't spawning in. And that seemed to have a, a very large negative impact. Um, you know, when I was running around looking for moa birds and so forth, they just weren't spawning in because there were so many darn zephyrs. And I think that's what they're called. So now Ambrosium's going... Whoa. Going to go a little faster. Although, again, we can use it in that recipe to make that healing stone. And I'm going to make an enchanter. But here's what we're going to do. I'm going to have to get um, back to my base. 
I'm going to gather some goodies, and I'm going to move to a new location because gravitite apparently is now more common as an ore, natural ore. But the thing is, I have um, I've been running around here. All this terrain's already been generated, so the gravitite is going to be rare here. So I need to move. And I'm going to go catch you, pig. I have. Oh, this is going to be cool. Oh gosh. I have to learn to jump a little faster. Um, oh, I just see. Yep. Yeah. So gravitite is going to be more common. Xanite apparently is going to be less common. So there's a little bit of a trade-off there. But in the seven tour videos that I did, I had only found two pieces of gravitite, and that's why I was getting very frustrated. So this is going to be very nice now once I move, get to a new location. Apologize for the darkness here. I thought I'd be out of here by now. Come on. There we go. Yeah, piggy, 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 piggy. All right, I'm going to slap a saddle on you. We're going to go fly home. Woohoo! When pigs fly. Is that a pig or a fig? Hey, look. Oh, here's something new. Cow. Ooh, cow with wings. And. Stay. They drop leather. So now we have bunnies that drop string. Cows that drop leather. So now we can make endless supplies of settlers. Now the eager plants are apparently spawning has been tweaked as well. We should hopefully see more of those. So then I can start working on my moas. Go hatch my eggs. There's a couple of cows over there. Very nice. Man, I am chock full of goodies here. There's some xanite over there. Let's go grab the xanite. Ooh, nice gliding ability there, sir. Drop. Now, can I mine with riding you? Yeah, not so shabby. Just don't want to hit you. Very convenient. Let's go. All right, I saw my little cave over here, my dungeon home that I built. Oh, whirlwind. This is something new, too. Now, this is an, a hostile mob. Let's go check them out. Not sure what they drop. All right, you stay here. Now these guys will still wander off. So you gotta be careful where you leave them. Hey, you! Whirly! Eek. Are you dead? Are you dropping sand? Are you throwing sand at me? Get... I got my arrow back. So whirlwinds, if you make contact with them, will pick you up and drop you. What is it? It's just regular sand. Cool. I guess if I want to get sand here, that's how to do it. Oh man, these things wander off. Now apparently the moas, tamed moas with a saddle, will stand in one spot. They don't wander off. Um, I'm not sure why pigs... Oh, okay, I thought that was something new. It's just my gravel. Get my arrow. Alright, now let's find the beacon to my home. I think it's over there. Come on, fella. Touch down so I can get another leap. Oh, you are terrible. Bunny. Okay, here's the dungeon over here. There's one of my beacon markers, and oh, there it is. Okay, it's the big H. H for home. More bunnies. Let's see, I have one piece of string. I I guess I don't need to kill him.
Nice Glide. Clyde. I'm going to call you Clyde. That's a good name. I don't really think I need the sand. You make it over there, Clyde? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Just don't want to hit Clyde with my pick. That would be bad. Did we get all that? Oh, get in there. Hey! I think I saw more. No? Yep. Oh, Clyde. Sorry. Oh, jeez. Alright, maybe I should dismount. Dismount! I'm afraid I'll lose Clyde if I dismount. Well, let's go fly over here. What's over here? Oh, wait, I just saw the plants. I saw something blue. Yeah! Let's go get them. Oh, gosh. Keep smacking my head, Clyde. Chill, man. Clyde, you are a nasty little pig. Don't jump when there's bricks above your head. That's the lesson. All right, Clyde, I'm going to have to put you... Let's see, can I get down here? Yeah. All right, Clyde, just get inside here. Stay. Okay. We good? No. <laughs> I forgot Clyde has wings. Clyde, stay. Be right back. So, now we have, uh, eager plants. Acre plants. Fine. It is ether, by the way. I get a lot of corrections. Alright, so I can steal some poison from these guys, right? And get petals to tame the moas. Let's go see if I can run up and steal something. But they shoot at you. Oh, I got it. I got some poison. Ow. Oh, oh run. Jump. Get out of there. Clyde, come get me. Alright, now I'm just taking poison damage. I don't think they can shoot this far. I think they can only shoot a few blocks, but... But this poison lasts quite a while. But I snagged some. Check it out. Poison bucket. Wow, you really do go through the Ambrosium now, don't you? Now, if I burn this guy, I may lose... I may lose the petals. I want to get his petals. Ooh, we hit both of them. Hmm. Yeah. Die. All right, petals dropped. That's cool. Get rid of that. All right, my first petals. Very nice. Very nice indeed. cranking through here. Now that it's damaged, it becomes more efficient. Very nice. So, um, the music, there is apparently some custom music made for the mod now, which is playing right in the background. Alright, Clyde, you're still here? Good puppy. Oh, I didn't kill a boss here. Apparently I, f I missed one. Have I not even been here yet? Clyde, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. Alright, Clyde, let's let's get out of here. This isn't the right place. Oh gosh. Ow. You're not so good underground, are you, piggy? Stop. I don't think we can make that jump. Well, maybe we can. Yeah, we did it. We did it. Just me and you, pig. Just me and you is my beacon. Okay, I think it's on the other side of this. Whew, man, you can motor. Up, 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 up. Dang it. 
Can you do like a little jump instead of a full blown leap? Okay. Yeah, I did find a second floor, by the way, in the end of the last tour. I recorded it, but there's really no sense in uploading it at this point. Come on, Clyde, we can do this. There we go. Good pig. Okay.